hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we'll be looking at how to use zenmap to run nmap commands using a graphical user interface and this will enable us to discover open ports on a target machine the target machine i'll be using here is a metasploitable which is uh, intentionally vulnerable and we can use it to test penetration testing tools like nmap so I uh, will open a terminal and then open ZenMap. You can use the terminal, you can search for it. I'll say sudo ZenMap. So this is the ZenMap. And this allows us to send commands to a target machine by you know picking the commands that we want to send and then the commands are going to be displayed here so it's a little different than nmap which you have to send same commands using the terminal now before i begin sending the commands here or the scan commands i'll open metasploitable just to show you which device it is so this is the metasploitable and uh, the ip address is i already ran if config the IP address is 172.16.1.100 and that's what we're going to input here as our target 172.16.1.100 and you can also check on a browser since there is a web server running on uh, the target machine we can check that by going to the browser and then just type 172 dot 16.1.100 and this is the target machine right here let us write about two so i'm gonna minimize this and now once you put in the target ip address here are the options for the scans so from the bottom they are the less intense ones and as you go up they're the more comprehensive ones uh we can start for instance if you want to do a regular scan can click regular scan which is this command here nmap and then the IP address and then just click on scan and it's done scanning and it's returned the, the device IP uh, the ports that are open the MAC address you can also see here the ports under ports and, uh, slash hosts you see the port numbers protocol the state is open and then the services so we have ftp uh, 22 for ssh and so on and then here you can see the host details again you have the ip address mac address number of open ports uh, closed ports and the number of ports that were scanned uh, we can do another scan here we can go with the quick scan that's the uh, command nmap command for quick scan right here just click scan and it returns pretty much almost the same information now if you wanted to do like a more comprehensive or detailed scan you can move up to the let's say the intense scan again the command is right here nmap-t4-a-v then the IP address of the target device and we'll do scan this takes a little longer but it's it's much more comprehensive in terms of what it's scanning for so it's going to scan for open ports services the details of the uh, services and this depending on how many ports are found to be open it might take a while to complete the scan so it even does that trace route as you can see here if we scroll back we can see we can see all the information that it it returned for us so it, disco it discovered open ports and then it went through tried to find more details on the services so you have the the port um 21 tcp open service and then the version as well so it's more detailed like i was saying um, compared to the other quick uh, scans which 
just tell you the open ports and don't provide more detailed information, such as uh, the, the version number of the, uh, the service that's running. So that's pretty much it for this video. That's how you can use uh, ZenMap to discover any open ports and uh, services on a target device. It's an alternative tool that does scanning just like uh, Nmap would, but it's using a graphical user interface and not the terminal. I hope this uh, information has been useful. I'll see you all in my next video. Thanks. Bye.